you hit the road. But what about our four-legged friends? The weather's warming up, the kids getting out of school soon, a lot of us doing more traveling with our pets, of course. They're members of the family. They're going to go right along with us. But what are we doing about traveling with our pets safely? We have Avery Thrasher here from Unleash Magazine. It's an online magazine all about your pets, and he's here to discuss some safety tips with us. Thank you so much for Thank being you. here. Thank you. Uh, you probably travel with your pet a lot. I not do. just, you know, some people don't, they don't do that until they go to the vet or something like that or the right. groomers, but some people take their dogs everywhere. So if they you're do. traveling with your pet, there are some things that we, we really need to look out for. You do, you do. Like you said, the weather's getting warmer, uh -huh. uh, the kids getting out of school soon, and people are going to be traveling more with their pets, but there's a couple of tips you can do to kind of ensure their safety. Okay, now I heard you mention uh, you know, that we see the dogs with their little heads hanging out of the window. They look so happy. And you said yeah. that's not a good idea, though. Yeah, they might be happy, but it's not too safe for yeah. them. Yeah, with their heads out of the window, they can be susceptible to any, anything that's in the air. Yeah. It's fine in the air. Cold air is kind of forced into their lungs. It's, it's not safe, safe for them. Yeah, so yeah. What, how do you suggest we travel with them then? They definitely shouldn't be riding shotgun in the passenger seat with okay. you. No, they should be in the back seat in a crate or carrier, something that's well ventilated and something that's anchored to your, to your, to your, seat, your vehicle seat. Yeah, yeah. and you want to make sure that uh, you have them safely in the car just like you would uh, right. any other member of the family that was that size. If they're that small, if anything happens, uh, you know, like you have an accident or something like that, you will want them secure in there just like everybody else. Certainly, certainly. So the crates are a very good idea yeah. for that. Yeah. Okay. Well, what are, what are some of the other tips that you can give us as far as making sure that you're traveling and, and your pet is comfortable as well? You should bring his supplies along. Okay. You know, bring kind of a doggy pack along with his favorite foods, his favorite uh, chew toys, uh, definitely some water for hydration. Mm -hmm. And then take a few breaks, just like we need breaks along right, the way. Right, right. Uh, you might need a break along the way as well. Uh, tell us what else we can look forward to as far as the uh, magazine. What are you working on as far as articles? Well, we're that? constantly, we're constantly working. Uh, we check us out online. We feature a lot of celebrity entertainers, professional athletes, and paid, paid industry tastemakers with their dogs. We keep you updated with different doggy, yeah. <laughs> doggy news well, products. And I love this. Speaking of uh, being in fashion and uh -huh. and, and what. What yeah. all the all the cool dogs Check are wearing out. right now? Tell us about this. This is super cute. Well, this is well, this is Daphne. She's a Karen Terrier. Hi, Daphne, is this your dog? This is my dog. She's at the Montgomery Humane Society. So she's adoptable. She is adoptable. Okay, so she if you're adoptable. looking at her going, oh my goodness, I want this dog. Go out there. She's getting ready to take a nap, I think. She is loving you. You're tickling her. She's loving that little massage she's getting right now. But if they want to have a little shirt like that for Daphne or, or whatever dog they have, where can they get one of those? They can get one at the Montgomery Humane Society and a portion of the proceeds will be going to the Montgomery Humane Society. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah. Okay, well, another great way to give back to a great cause. You can go see them right. over on John Overton Drive and uh, you can give them a call. And of course, our friend Lee will be here tomorrow from the Montgomery uh, Humane Society with another adoptable pet because I'm sure this one will be gone. Bye right. today, Debbie. You're adorable. <laughs>